Here we go on the Great Divide. Uh, right over here, about 20 feet, 25 feet. That's the, the ground that uh, watershed flows in that direction, but it's flat. It's flat, there's, uh, there's no torrent there. There's no creek there. Uh, it turns into Sitlington Creek later on, but it, it doesn't have any, uh, any rhythm to it. Now this is uh, Knapps Creek coming out of here, out of this little hollow here, and it, uh, it rained last night, yesterday, and it's feeding this on down in here. And if you look back here, you can see where it goes in a S shape and it keeps on going, finding its way down through here. Uh, but in a way, this is a rhythm and this is a torrent. Uh, and what is that coming from? Well, melody is flat, uh, but rhythm has to come out of here, out of the pulse. And what does the pulse do? Well, if it's in here, it's, it's like this. The pulse just uh, cuts its way down through here and uh, it pushes it. And something gets in its way, well, it goes around it like that. But it keeps on going. That doesn't have anything. It's like a, a football field over there. Uh, there's, there's no no flow to it. So what I'm talking about with the pulse, just like it cuts out down through here, uh, the rhythm cuts it out. Well, I want this music to cut deep inside of here. It can't cut here. When I say the word music, uh, this over here is a small M. It's melody and uh, it's a, if that's all you can do, well, that's okay, but uh, this music comes out of here. This is a capital M. It, it takes on its own life. Uh, uh, I mean, a life of its own. And it, it just drives down through here. And that's what I want inside of you, is uh, let the pulse cut its own way inside of you. So get over this thing of thinking that you can control this. You can control that. And people get a hold of that over there, the melody, and they argue about this note and that note and so-and-so uh, -and -so did it this way and so-and-so did it that way. Well, if you go to here in West Virginia, there's say 10 or 15 fiddlers playing uh, Jimmy Johnson, and that was one of the favorite ones, or you Piney Mountain, and what were they doing? They were playing different melody notes, different ones, and uh, so they didn't sit around and argue over whether so-and-so did this melody note or that melody note. They were using notes melody notes than to cut the rhythm. So melody notes have to be like a knife, have to be like a knife and it just cuts, cuts in deep. And uh, as I've told students, uh, if you're not used to rhythm, this over here is safe. But if you're, if you're not used to rhythm, your system in here will uh, reject it. It'll get upset. You won't like rhythm uh, because you can't control it. That's why I put a capital M on music over here. You can't control it. As I said, it has a life of its own. Uh, so it's not you. Rhythm is not you. Rhythm is like uh, uh, the sun hitting the moon and then it flies out. Well, that's what uh, uh, we're to be a conduit. We're to be a uh, reflection 
of something that comes in that has a life of its own. The sunlight, bang. Well, that's scary. And it's like walking out here and trying to walk up up to this little creek right here, coming Naps Creek, coming out of the holler. Well, you have to do you have to balance. You have to balance what you're doing. You don't have to balance your way over through there. Yeah, there's some trees, but you don't have to, to try to keep from uh, getting your feet in the water. Uh, and that's what you have to do with this music is try to uh, keep that balance, keep your uh, um, anticipating. And that's what I want you to do with uh, the beat is get ahead of it. And um, a friend of mine was talking about the way she t learned to type. And she was in a class, and she was having trouble with it. And what the teacher told her to do was, instead of trying to look at notes in, in type, to just let her fingers be loose and look ahead uh, at the words ahead, and the fingers start following it. Well, that's what I want for you. Uh, I want you to quit watching the, the water, trying to quit watching the water, but just let it flow. Because watching the water, that water's moving, you can't watch it. But if you just let it flow, then uh, your mind can't control it. This is the pulse. You just keep picking up the pulse. Thank you.